Hi, this is Tim Mix, a baritone originally from the Washington, D.C. area. My name is David Lefkowitz, and I was the stage director of Puccini's Tosca at Annapolis Opera last season. The role of Scarpia. I've always liked the bad guys anyway. I just always felt like they fit a little better. I'm not really the heartthrob type, and there really isn't anybody who's more evil than Scarpia. He's got to be very calm, collected, suave, sophisticated, a little sexy, and then on a dime, cutting! And just that switch between the calm, collected exterior and that fire he's got inside. Oh, it's the best. There just isn't a good bone in his body. And how much fun is that? <laughs> Tosca is one of those incredible experiences where even if you're listening to it for the first time, you can't help but fall in love. The music, the passion, the romance, the intensity, all fuse together into one horrifying, incredible evening. This production, we decided to set in World War II, and we allowed the idea of fascism to creep in. Scarpia, our villain in this opera, becomes a Mussolini-esque figure, taking what he wants, and using anything to stay in control. designer Tim Maccabee found this incredible drawing of a building called the Danteum, which was going to be the center of fascism if the fascists won World War II, and it served as a perfect backdrop for all three of the locations of Puccini's Tosca, with a Viva Il Duce on top looking down at all times. By setting this piece also in a different time period, it allows us to play with costumes, lighting, and all sorts of other things that breathe new life into this piece. I would say that this is the best Tosca I've ever been a part of, and I'm proud to say so. It was an incredibly exciting adventure, and I'm so thrilled that Annapolis Opera had me out there, and I cannot wait to be back this season, whenever it is we're allowed to gather again.